Hi, do you have a meddling family member? Then this is for you. I'm Katherine O'Brien at HappyWithBaby.com and in this video we'll be talking about three tips for dealing with your in-laws or as some say, your outlaws. So it's so important to remember now that you are the parents to be able to uh, make decisions based on what you guys want for your family. So first of all, you want to make sure that you set those boundaries. Um, you want to make sure that you have um, defined the expectations that you have regarding your feelings, your thoughts, um, how you want holidays and vacations to go. So it's so important that you and your partner talk about this so that um, in this next step, step number two, you can be direct with your family members. Um, um, and you can do so in a way that's gentle. You don't have to be like, no, this is what we want. You just say, you know, this is this is what we want for our family. This is what, um, you know, we want to try out. And now granted, sometimes what you think that you want, it does change. And you can have those things change as a family. You know, talk about it and then share with others, you know, how you want things to go. Like maybe you always decide, hey, we want to just spend, you know, the holidays as a family, our family unit. But then as things go along, you decide like, no, it would be kind of fun to have more family around, you know, so maybe we will go on, um, go away every other year or something. So it's okay to change your mind, but just make sure that you set the boundaries that you guys want and don't feel like others put that pressure on you. Make sure that you're doing this because it's what, what you feel is important for you um, as a family. And then just be direct with the others. And so then tip number three is to, you know, kind of maintain that united front. You know, if one, you have a family member that might be more meddlesome than others and comes to you and says, hey, we want you guys to come for the holidays. You know, we want you to do this because of X, Y, and Z, and you feel a lot of pressure, you know, just say, hey, um, okay, well, I will talk to my partner about this later. And then, you know, we'll get back to you about whether this will work out for us. You know, don't feel that pressure. Um, to answer right away, you know, and you know, you want to make sure that you are maintaining that united front and, um, and not having, you know, people come to you and, um, when your other partner isn't there and feeling like you need to make a decision. And just for a bonus tip, it's okay to say no. <laughs> if there's something that you know you don't want to do, isn't right for your family, isn't right for your values or, um, your traditions, then go ahead and say no. Um, it's not the right time for us. So I hope these are helpful to you. Um, go ahead and list in the comments below things that you have found helpful for dealing with um, your in-laws or outlaws as they say. And um, wishing you the best and 